Hi, my name is Isaac from Smith's Renault in Peterborough and today we are here with the all-new Renault Scenic E-Tech 100% Electric, the 2024 car of the year. At Smith's Renault we sell cars right across the UK and also offer nationwide delivery. If you'd like to find out more about the new Scenic, book a test drive or see our latest deals, please visit smithsrenault.co.uk. So starting at the front of the new Scenic, it's got a bold and impressive design. The most standout feature is this unique pattern on the front grille. And you've also got these angular daytime running lights on either side that are familiar from the new Clio. You've also got the Nouveau R badge in the middle as well. And uh, I think overall it's quite a nice looking front. So the size of the alloy wheels depends on the specification that you choose. On this is pretty alpine we have 20 inch alloys and on the top spec as well is 20 inch. If you go for the Techno which is the entry level trim it's 19 inch but all of the designs look really good and these ones match the Esprit Alpine detailing really nice. So from the side you'll notice uh, that this model has a two-tone roof and it's also finished in this really nice matte grey paint as well. There's also roof rails here at the top if you want to add a roof box or other Renault accessories as well. And now if we come around to the rear, we have a rear brake light that's integrated into the roof spoiler. Uh, also got scenic lettering down here, which is underneath the badge. And on the side here, you've got the E-Tech electric badge as well. So inside the new Scenic, there's lots of premium materials. You've got a nice soft touch finish on the dashboard. And also you've got these blue accents on the side on the Spree Alpine trim. If you step up to the Iconic, you get wood instead on the sides, which looks really nice. And you also get a light gray interior. On a Spree Alpine trims, you also get these really nice sports seats that have blue stitching around the edges and uh, also the Alpine badge that's embossed in the upper part of the seat. So inside the back of the Scenic, there's quite a lot of leg and headroom, and that's because of the 2.78 metre long wheelbase. There's also a flat floor as well. Um, that means you can stretch your legs out and it's really good if you've got a middle seat passenger. Now, quite a cool feature about the new Scenic is this innovative smart armrest. And essentially, it allows you to charge two devices through the USB-C ports that are here. And you can also prop up your phone so you can watch videos whilst driving and you can also charge your phone at the same time. New to the Renault range, the Solar Bay Opacifying Glass Roof lets in a vast amount of natural light. Gone are the days of waiting for the sunshade to open and close, as with a simple voice command, your Google Assistant will instantly change the opacity of the sunroof. So the boot space on the new Scenic is family size 2. There's a 545 litre boot capacity with the seats up, and with the seats down it increases to 1,670 litres. Renault's Open R system is the centre of attention inside. It features two screens, a 12-inch driver display cluster, as well as a 12-inch vertical touchscreen. The multimedia system has Google built in, running on Android Automotive OS 12, and features more than 50 apps available from Google Play, from music quizzes and family games to journey planning and your favorite streaming services. Four multi-sense modes, Comfort, Sport, Eco, and Perso, provide different atmospheres by combining the indoor lights, driver seat comfort, indoor temperature and screen colour in varying ways with the driving sensations such as steering wheel resistance, powertrain calibration and pedal response. The journey planner has been optimised by Google and Renault engineers for electric vehicles and considers the need to precondition the battery temperature when nearing charging stops on the journey. This allows the system to make smarter decisions about where to charge, optimising charging time. The Scenic E-Tech Electric comes with two powertrain configurations. The first uses a 125 kilowatt or 170 horsepower motor with 280 newton meters of torque. This is powered by a 60 kilowatt hour battery pack, delivering a range of around 260 miles on a single charge. The second features a 160 kilowatt or 220 horsepower motor with 300 newton meters of torque coupled with a larger 87 kilowatt hour pack that is targeted to achieve more than 370 miles on a single charge. A heat pump is standard in the Scenic E-Tech Electric, helping to recover the heat and energy that would otherwise be wasted. As a result, drivers can enjoy up to around 2 hours of range on the motorway by charging just for 30 minutes. The Scenic is based on the modular CMF EV platform and features a long wheelbase of 2.78 metres combined with wide wheel tracks and a wheel at each corner stance that aids stability. The steering ratio of 12, the lowest on the market, matches that of the Megane E-Tech Electric. With the parallel link multi-link rear axle, the result is a tight curb-to-curb -curb turning circle of 10.9 meters, 
together with excellent handling and steering precision. With the Scenic, there's plenty of punch to reach motorway speeds easily. The suspension has been damped well and is tuned for comfort, but is also agile through tight bends. The car feels composed on untidy back roads, so there's nothing to worry about there. The steering is nice and light too, but if you prefer for it to be a bit heavier, you can put the car into sport mode. There are three levels of regenerative braking that uses energy usually lost when braking to recharge the battery. This can be turned off entirely to coast freely if you prefer to. The Scenic is equipped with over 30 advanced driver assistance and safety systems, including the new tool called Safety Coach. Safety Coach assesses driving behaviour and habits to provide tailored advice on driving style and ADAS use. The system gathers data from various vehicle sensors and analyses key factors such as acceleration, distance from other vehicles, speed limit awareness and more. Of particular use to young drivers, the system can help develop good driving habits that improve the safety of all occupants on board. The new motorway and traffic assistant, Active Driver Assist, combines adaptive cruise control, stop and go, lane centering and geolocation data to adapt predictively to the road. At low speeds, such as in a traffic jam, the lane centering system can be adjusted by the driver to keep the vehicle to one side of the road to ease the passage of emergency vehicles. So thank you very much for joining me on this tour of the new Renault Scenic E-Tech 100% electric. If you'd like to find out more CL Lotus deals or book a test drive, please visit smithrenault.co.uk. Thank you for watching.